Howdy, howdy. This car been all shot up. Uh, you can tell it's bought out in the country or actually I think they come from a gun range. You can go out there and shoot a car. Nice shot group on that 22 there. I guess I'm, I don't know, I gotta get going, but howdy, howdy. Let's get going. That's cool this morning. My hands are cold. Come on, let go, Will. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, when you um when you go to buy the car, you know the people are like uh you, know, you tell them I'm, they'll say, hey, you know the motor's still good. That's got to be worth five hundred dollars, and you just tell them like, no, we're we're crushing these cars, and they're like, you're crushing it. Well, yeah, that's all we're gonna do. That's why it's only worth you know two fifty. 200 bucks and they're like well can I bust all the windows and you're like yeah go for it <laughs> uh, you know they're like uh, can I smash the doors with a hammer yeah go for it I remember one time these kids I don't know they're 17 18 and it was like one of the kids first car and he paid like $400 for it and he just run into it to it was almost blowed up I think it was a Ford Taurus or a Tempo and you know the, it come across the scales it was a scrap guard it was bought for weight and they're like what are y'all gonna do with it and they're like well we're gonna crush it you know we'll remove it you know blah 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 we'll get it all up and he goes well, man like can I watch y'all crush it and I was like well man why don't you try blowing that motor up and then we can do it. He's like, for real? <laughs> and man, he sat down there and just pegged that throttle and pegged it. And I said, man, you remember on the, on the way over here, there was a set of railroad tracks. And he's like, yeah. I was like, well, why don't you go dig some hazard that railroad, those railroad tracks? <laughs> he's like, for real? <laughs> man, I shouldn't have been encouraging people to do stuff like that. <laughs> but yeah, we, we, uh, crushed it for him and hang on Mario I'll be over a second I've been trying to I've been keep telling him like dude I can hop down and crush you know first car second car I think he's trying to keep moving to stay warm hang on Mario Ranger. Well, they deboned it, or they got a lot off of it. Easy. Stupid Saturn. That's an eggshell of a car. I don't get it. He's already waving me off. Brother, I can crush a car, man. Yeah, your Saturns, you want to put them on the bottom. And in the middle, definitely not on the top. And just you just gotta pick and poke and knock off, you know, a lot of that plastic junk. And you gotta pick it all up. 
Thank you, Saturn. I mean, is it Saturn's fault? I mean, when you make a product, do you, are you expecting how it's going to go at the, what do they call it, the end of life of the vehicle? Well, I mean, well, I read an article in one of those uh, scrapyard recycle business uh, magazines. And it said that Ford Motor Company at one time had owned 30% of junkyards in America so either they knew they were manufacturing junk and they could make money on both ends of it I don't know that's too big for me to think about <laughs> oh shoot we're just crushing cars hope everybody's doing all right I think they want the differential off of it they got it halfway unbuckled I mean, why would you get it halfway unbuckled and then... Anyway, I gotta get the wheels off of it anyway. I shall find out. I think we'll be crushing this guy a couple of days. I see a bunch of Cadillacs, Johnny. Hey, what we got? One, two, three. Sorry, homie. <laughs> Sorry, homie. I ain't the dude that buys them. <laughs> I just smash them. Smash them. Well, in the wintertime, I, uh, believe it or not, I, I keep these doors open quite a bit and they heat her off and, I mean, Mario's out in the junk. Summertime is different. All this glass, you can get working sometimes in certain yards and there's like no wind. The fence, the spot you're in, there's no wind and this thing just turns into a fishbowl and you're up here sweating and you're getting frustrated and it ain't cool. It ain't cool. But in the wintertime, you know, I put on a pair of gloves or put on a coat. And Mario's out in the junk, right? All right, I think he's done with this focus. See? I did it again. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. I apologize. That's my, that's my editing, folks. Pause. Record. <laughs> I apologize. Hey, same old cowboy. It's been like this the whole time. Remember when the phone used to fall all the time? Remember them videos? I kind of miss them. I think some folks really do. <laughs> Ain't nothing changed. ¿Qué pasó? Es que es el differential? Man. I'll crush it, you know, like they got their own little forklift, they got their deal. <laughs> I'm trying to do the right thing. Why would you unbuckle it? Why would you unbolt it? But why wouldn't you unbolt it and then stack it on top of something else? See my point? Maybe their battery ran out on their impact. Who knows? I think the battery, speaking of batteries, I'm, uh, the battery's in the back of this car. Got to tear the back gate open. There you go, Mario. Hey, Mario. Check out the loose adentro. They're already pulled, they're just laying inside there. I mean, I don't know what tail lights they are just yet, but they're already pulled. That's what I'm talking about. Five dollars, ten dollars. Get it, Mario. Do your thing, homie. Oh, 
What we got? What we got? There's a mirror I need to get out of my way before it turns into 15 pieces. I've asked this question all the time. So, we all have heard the deal breaking a mirror. It gets you seven years back. Man, I better get on these K-frames. That's what I need to do. If I if I break a mirror out here at the job, do I get them seven years bad luck? There's three or four, you know, there's three mirrors on a car. Or is that that's occupational, right? That's what I'm saying. That don't count. Because if so, I'm screwed for like a, a million years. Easy. So I've got enough room over there right now to take the whole thing over there. I guess I do. Let me crush a couple things and I'll have enough room to take it all over there. See what Mario can get with it all just sitting right there. All you boys finally reporting for duty, huh? Good morning. I crush one more car. I have plenty of room to bring that whole deal over here. That Ranger's still draining. We can do this real fast. Package them uh, those brown cotton gloves. I don't want to wear work gloves and get my controls all nasty. Or I could just turn the heater on. That's an option as well. <laughs> Put that Ranger on top of that. Boom, boom, boom. We'll be crushing cars. That hanging differential is probably going to give me a hard time. Down. I heard the price of metal went back up. It usually does. It seems like you know, wintertime them steel mills kind of put in some work. In my experience. Man, that door kind of got out on me. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Anyway, I gotta get a car on the rack. That's what has to happen. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, get all that tucked up in there. All right, Mario. Super Mario. You ought to see him when it starts raining a little bit. That man works in between the raindrops. For real. Get the truck and a drop on him. Try to keep the driveway clean because a record come in any minute with the car. Just... What? I was looking behind me. I left one on the forks. <laughs> The only thing about wintertime is there's some uh, there's some circus people that live on the other side of this um, fence. Some circus entertainers, and they'll set up their equipment, and they'll they they got that one thing that looks like a like two uh, what are those wheels that them hamsters run around on? Anyway, it looks like two of those, like a giant Q-tip, and they'll get in there and they'll they'll do they'll practice their routine. I don't have that thing whip, whipping and spinning. And I'm crushing cars and watching like circus entertainment, like a Vegas show, for real. <laughs> I won the lottery of nine to fives. Thank you. I mean, who gets to do that at work? Let's just let's just pop some off and see what happens. I know there's some that's underneath everything, but see what we can get right now. I wonder if he brought his impact with him today. I think that HHR is finished. They're, they're a pain in the butt. Oh, don't do that too much, man. The battery's right there. Plastic always stays. The plastic that's on the back of the door. Oh look, they got a bunch of junk in there. Maybe they already pulled the battery. Probably so, but and you gotta look. It is what it is. There's aluminum wheels in the front seat. Jeez.
come on. Sometimes you don't got to be so hard with it. Roll it out, come on. There you go, Bubba. There you go. There you go. he was able to get off. Let's get something else on the rack. I think they got that crown big chassis and cat and a body separated the body will stay with the or the tank will stay with the body he can still keep going on them tires and wheels and still have something draining i think it looks like it is that's usually how they do it in the word smiling styling and profiling got me a fresh haircut shoot brand new cowboy hat man put that mask on that's it I'm stunning them show stopping howdy cowboy howdy <laughs> that mask ain't done nothing but improve my game <laughs> Confidence level 100%. <laughs> What's that emoji? He's got that arm. Strong. Like it's, like it's pumping his fist. There's Mario. There he is. There he is. I ain't gonna move. So he's ready. I need to get it out of his way so he can move the gas buggy around. Oh, it's got a, they're tight. He needs me to hold on to press down. The key to it is not to press too hard because then it's like you're putting so much pressure on it, you're just tightening them up. There you go. The piddliest stuff will slow you down. This right here. They'll just break them and then I go back to smashing something. I hear I got them all lit up. Watch it. Watch it. Watch it. Watch it. Right. Let's see if we can get this HHR in there. Come on. Give it up. Give it up. There we go. Give it up. Oh, that sun's coming out. That's what I'm talking. I'm like a lizard. Where's the sun? Where's the sun? <laughs> like an iguana. A car crushing iguana. Woo! Hey, that's something I ain't crushed yet, or, or have I? I think that one yard where we did a whole bunch of cars, I think there was a tiguana in there. <laughs> Put that on a beer koozie. Car crushing iguana. 
<laughs> I'm in a good mood, folks. I'm happy. Doing my thing. Working out real good this morning. Get it, Mario. Break its back, Bubba. Break its back. I'll do something with that forward door. There it is. There it is. Tucked it back in. Good this morning. Good this morning. All right, folks, this video is getting kind of long. Y'all be careful, be kind. Happy holidays. Everything's going to be all right. Thank you.